Christmas is as merry as it can be inside the Village Bakehouse, a sweet sliver of Oro Valley. We first met owner Paulette Griggs in March at the start of the pandemic. She had just gotten a loan from the federal government. Nine months later, coming off her busiest time of the year. Those are the almond crescents. Those are one of my favorites. Paulette says she and her employees need more help. Usually January and February are slow for us, and so that can be difficult to keep everybody employed. And then if this lingers on into summer, it's really going to be rough to hold on. President Trump is threatening to veto the $900 billion coronavirus relief bill, demanding Congress boost the $600 individual stimulus checks to $2,000. A Democratic effort to do just that, blocked by House Republicans Thursday morning. Also in the bill, unemployment and rental assistance. $600, I mean, that goes so fast. That doesn't even pay somebody's rent for one month here in Tucson, let alone in states where the rent is $2,000. I mean, what does $600 do for somebody? I just, I just think it needs to be more. We still have to pay our bills and make ends meet with our families. The stimulus check will help boost us in the right direction. Paulette opened the bakery in 1996. She says really in the like current environment, Paulette every day is a challenge. Point. It's the closest she's come to considering closing her shop. Thank you. Thank you. Merry Thank Christmas. You. Oh. You're welcome. And for her, that possibility is hard to even begin to process. I don't know what I would do. I don't know. I, I have no idea. It, it, it would be crazy. I, I don't know. I'd have to do something. I, I just, it would be devastating. Now also included in the stimulus bill, the money needed to keep the federal government open and running past Monday. We've got you covered live tonight in Oro Valley. I'm Eric Fink, News 4, Tucson.